Wheelchair rugby is a really unique sport because there's not an able body comparison to it. So it's, it's a mixture of rugby, soccer, handball, maybe even a little bit of basketball in there. I think it's one of the most popular disabled sports out there. People, when they learn about it, they want to come see it. They love it. They really enjoy it. I love the camaraderie and I love like the intensity of it and how there's really no, it's like show me what you can do, don't tell me what you can do. You can't be afraid to get hit and you can't be afraid to hit somebody. It's a contact sport, that's why they call it a contact sport. It's empowering and it's exciting and it makes the game that much more intense and that much more lovable, I, I would say, especially for people with my kind of demeanor. We practice, we train, um, we teach people safe ways to play. Um, the chairs have straps, so you may have a, a lap belt, a foot belt, even a chest strap to keep you in your chair. The chair really is part of your body when you're moving, you want it to stay with you. Um, so believe it or not, even though there's so much contact, we don't tend to see a lot of a lot of injuries with wheelchair rugby. Once you get involved and you have just a bunch of people that are on your side cheering you on, getting you to start to see yourself or who you can become. And then as you begin to grow in the sport and you become that person, your confidence builds. There's no way it can't. It's great because it's not just like empowering, like smashing into someone and make you feel powerful again but it also like, makes you feel part of a community as well. You feel so great coming off, coming off the court at the end of a game. Win, lose, it's, they're all learning experiences. It really is a sport that allows you to play as long as you want to play. So that's, that's been something that I've been really happy about because I am playing at a later point in my life and it does allow me to continue to have this outlet that other sports might not allow for. And then I found wheelchair rugby and I found other men, women, who have the same disabilities but they were out there getting it. They were pushing and living their life to the fullest and they, it gave me uh, a window to see what my future could be like and, uh, and now I'm living that same life.